Hi everyone, I hope that you're well. I'm coming to you today with a new vlog, pretty much straight after I've finished the last one. Um, so I have just launched my new collection that I've been talking about for the last few videos. I finally launched them on the website, they're now live, and I've just done a big long post about it on Instagram, and I need to do one for Facebook. So yeah, hopefully it all goes well. I'm not expecting like anything to sell out straight away, this is more just um, a case of being able to make everything live and to be able to promote it from now on so yes I'm excited about how it'll go I'll keep you updated I'll let you know if anything happens and yeah but for now I'm happy everything's live so yes I will chat to you in a little bit hello it is Tuesday and I've had an order for some cards from Becky if you're watching um and yeah so far everyone seems to like the fox best so that's interesting i always like to know what design people prefer it's good to know but yeah so i need to pack that i've been just doing some filming editing and commissions so far today I've just had my lunch it's actually like a bit further on in the day but yeah i need to do some packing soon and i'm just gonna do a bit more on commissions first i think so yeah chat to you in a bit. Right, I'm just going to pack Becky's order from my website. She's ordered three cards, so I need one of these big boxes. One of my new box club cards, a big card, a tabby cat card. So I'm just going to pop them in there. Morning, it's now Wednesday. I didn't really film much yesterday. I was just getting on with commissions and filming and whatnot. So I didn't really have much to show. Um, but today I've had three orders on Etsy. Quite big orders as well, I can't believe it. So I've had three on Etsy and I've had one on my website. By the way, if you can hear that humming, it's my laptop. I'm just uh, exporting a video. Yeah, I've had one on my website. So yeah, that's really exciting. I'm gonna pack those now. The Fox card is definitely proving to be the most popular, which I, to be fair, I do think that's probably like one of the nicest ones, but yeah, always interesting to see what everyone prefers. But yeah, just gonna pack those now and catch up in a bit. got the Les Mis soundtrack stuck in my head. I went to see it in Manchester, not last weekend, the weekend before. Oh, it was amazing. I absolutely love Les Mis. I'm such like a musical theatre person, I love it. It's like my favourite thing to do. Just printing that label. Okay, this next one is quite a big one. I think this is like the most variety anyone's ever ordered on Etsy. So this is for Julie. I don't know if Julie would be watching, but if you are, hello. Um, so, you've ordered a hair card, a Kestrel card, a fox 
Box Clubs card. I need to order some more of these already. Uh, Border Collie. And a hair bookmark. And I've actually got some new packaging for these. So I was wrapping them individually in tissue paper, which was taking me quite a while. And to be honest, I'm not the neatest at wrapping in tissue paper. So I found these, are they called glassine bags? I'll link, I'll link them below, but I got them off Etsy and they fit perfectly. So I've just been putting them in there with a little sticker. Um, I don't really need a sticker, but I'll just do it for aesthetic effect. <laughs> I like that. And I just think that looks a bit neater. I like the way it looks. And they're eco-friendly, so win-win. So that is everything for that order. Thank you, Julie. So that is all my orders done for the day. Probably need to do another card order later and replace some of these ones that I'm selling out of. But yeah, I'm really happy with this. This has made me very, very pleased. So thank you everyone. So this weekend just gone, I went on a hen do to Chester for my cousin's wedding that's coming up in August. We're going to Greece. I cannot wait. But anyway, I went to Primark and they actually had some of these crates that I've been after for ages. And I really regret not getting more. I just feel like now the cards pull out a lot easier. There was too much weight in the other ones because I had so many in there. But yeah, oh, really wish I'd have got more of these. I might have to have a look at a Primark this weekend and I've just got them sat there so yeah kind of wish I got more I might even have to get a new one of these at some point like a second one to go there if I end up getting more stock but yeah I've gone from having like probably one of these worth of cards to two to now extra and bookmarks it's all it's all building up slowly but surely I haven't shown you the completed elephant yet, have I? So, this is it. No, oh, it's glory. I ended up just doing a little bit of a shadow rather than all the grass and stuff, but I'm really happy with how this turned out. I might just show it you in natural light as well. So, this is it in natural light. I'm really happy with how that turned out. Definitely going to make a greeting card out of that. When I ordered my... Um, when I order my fox cards, I'm going to add this to the order too. And the gorilla and the harvest mouse. I need to order lots more cards. But yeah, the slice tool was a huge help on this drawing. As you can see, I've scratched out lots of the colour. So yeah, if you fancy drawing that with me, head over to my Patreon. I'll link it down below. I'm going to carry on now with the koala, which is the new one for this month. I love this because it's got two koalas, a mother and a baby, and this is going to make a really cute, like, Mother's Day greeting card. Or Father's Day, if you, if you wanted to. But, um, yeah, that kind of thing anyway. I think it'll be really good for that. And, yeah, I th do you know what? I might start mounting all my cards. I just feel like they'd make cute little mini prints, wouldn't they? I think this one's going to be really cute. So, yeah, I'm going to get on with that now. Try your best to sort of keep watching which direction the fur is going in. As long as it doesn't look too straight and it looks a bit like random and textured, it's all good. It gets a bit lighter as you come this way. I'm going to leave a bit more like a gap between the first strokes. Kind of like a light bit here. 
there we go just finished the next part and i'm gonna nip to the post box now with all these orders post them and then come back and do some commissions and then i might do another part of this so i'll just give you a little close up but yeah i'm loving that so far just been working on this commission of Stella and I think I'm pretty much ready to call that one done now. I mean it's one of them when do you stop but I don't think I could add much more anyway. So I think what I'll do, this is part of two um, portraits that I'm doing. I might start the second one and then at the end compare them both and see if I need to add anything. But for now I'm going to call that one done. So yeah happy with that and I'll probably speak to you tomorrow. Hello everyone. So today's Friday, very random turn of events yesterday. So you might have seen the random videos of the food. So my cousin asked if I wanted to go to this new restaurant in Blackburn uh, that a friend manages and be in some pictures <laughs> for like promo shots that were taken for the website and Facebook and stuff. And it ended up taking most of the day, so... <laughs> We were just laughing, we were like, we thought it was going to be somebody with a phone camera just taking a few pictures, but it was like a full-on like professional <laughs> photo shoot, so yeah, I didn't end up really getting any footage yesterday. So today I'm going to catch up on everything and I've uploaded the next part of the koala tutorial, need to film another bit and I might do some commissions and then yeah, today's Easter, uh, Friday, good Friday, so I'm not going to do too much gonna just like get bits done plod along and not be too hard on myself so yeah i'm gonna start on that now got ducklings in the pond they come back every year you probably can't see them very well but they're so cute there's about 15. Hi everyone, ignore the fact that I've got wet hair, I've just had a shower and I want to let it dry naturally. So yes, I do not have a clue when the last time I filmed for this vlog was. I kind of started off really well and then I got a bit panicky towards the end because I had so much Patreon filming to do and I had commissions to do and I kind of just let the vlog slip because I was like, there's no way that I can concentrate on this and get everything done in the time frame. So. Yes, I've no idea what the last clip was, so just I'll put it all together and hopefully it'll be somewhat like interesting. But um, I ended up going to London last week. I think the last time I filmed for this vlog was weeks ago. But yeah, I went to London last week and I filmed some bits. I met up with a few artists from Instagram that I talked to um, and it was really nice to meet everyone face to face rather than just like over the internet like it usually is and it's just nice to chat to people that do the same thing as you because obviously it can be quite lonely doing something like this and you don't generally know many people in normal life that do anything similar so yeah it was really nice so I'll add all the clips in from that and hopefully this will be a good vlog when I come to edit it later but yeah it was really good and I think I'm gonna start a new vlog today so I'll probably look the same in the next vlog that I do. But yeah, I'm feeling better now. I, I still feel like I have so much to do. Like, I don't know what's happened recently, but since starting Patreon, I, I found it quite easy at the start and now it feels like I've got a lot to do. I think it's because obviously there was the lockdown and I wasn't really doing much. So I just spent all my time pretty much doing 
work and then now that I actually have a bit more of a life and I'm going out at the weekends doing things I'm not spending my Saturdays doing work like I usually would so that's already less time to work on everything but I'll get used to it it's just finding a good balance and making sure I'm not burning myself out but also getting everything done in like the time that I have and being productive and not like wasting my time and stuff so anyway I'll probably talk about that more in the next video but yes the next clip is when I went to London so I hope you enjoy I'll put it on now hi everyone I am going to London today it's quarter to seven in the morning which is quite early for me um, to be ready and up and I am going to meet up with some girls from Instagram who are also pet portrait artists so that should be a really good day out and I thought I would film it if I can I'll see what I can get but um thought it'd be a good excuse for a video so yes if they don't mind me filming but yeah I'm gonna set off now to the train station get the train and then I'll catch you up later And that is the end of the video. I hope you've enjoyed this one, even though it's a little bit disjointed and a bit all over the place. But hopefully it's still fun to watch nonetheless. So thank you very much for watching. Make sure to give this video a like if you enjoyed it and subscribe to see more and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.